To best look after the fish, we must coordinate our efforts globally. We need all hands on deck to achieve real change. We're heading in the right direction. We now have the key instruments, measures and global fora in place. Through close collaboration across sectors and with those who fish in oceans and fresh water, we can improve ocean governance and, ultimately, the health of our fish. This challenge isn't as daunting as it appears. A global network of regional fisheries management organisations and regional fisheries bodies is already in place to collaborate internationally to strengthen sustainable fisheries management, both in our oceans and inland waters. We need to put an end to criminal activity that hampers these efforts. Illegal, unreported and unregulated IUU fishing that is thought to represent 20% of total catches. Since 2016, an international treaty, the FAO Port State Measures Agreement, is ensuring illegally caught fish never enters markets through international ports. This and other international measures help guarantee sea to plate traceability so that we can identify and stamp out illegal activity across the market chain. But we can't ever forget about all those who depend on fish for their food and livelihoods. Small-scale fisheries communities make up 90% of the world's capture fishers and fish workers. The Voluntary Guidelines for Securing Sustainable Small-Scale Fisheries is the first internationally agreed instrument aimed at supporting and strengthening this vital community. And we must not forget that people are an integral part of the ecosystem, so we need to manage our oceans as one. We need to continue to innovate our understanding in response to the changing world around us. In coastal waters and beyond national jurisdictions, we need to keep asking the questions to help us enhance and implement the ecosystem approach to fisheries management in line with the globally agreed FAO Code of Conduct for Responsible Fisheries. How we act today will determine how we achieve the Sustainable Development Goals. There are many challenges before us. But with oceans high on the international political agenda, there's never been a better time.